Hey everyone, thanks for tuning in. Today we're going to be doing an unboxing of the Black Goat of the Woods expansion for Cthulhu Death May Die. But before we do that, obviously I want to tell you about the contest we're having. So for any subscriber that comments on any of my videos for the months of April 2020 to June 2020, up until the end of June 2020, uh, you'll be entered to win a copy of... Da -dum -da -da, Cthulhu Death May Die! Now, uh, there is only one copy to give away, so only one lucky subscriber will get this box. However, I do want to point out that uh, this box does have some damage. Here, now if you can see, there's a little dent here, kind of like cracked the box a little bit, but then there's some rough edging on the corners. Other than that, it's still a sealed copy of the game. So, without further ado, let's go ahead and focus on the table and unbox this. All right, so let's crack this thing open. So we should have six dark youngs and one black goat of the woods. Then we should have uh, four different elder one stage cards for the different phases of the elder god. Uh, looks like one minion card that's going to have different uh, stats for, looks like Cultus and maybe the Dark Young. And then there's going to be some Mythos cards thrown into the Mythos deck. So, uh, there we go. I did get this game. This game. I did get this expansion from uh, GameNerds.com. And I will provide a link in the description below if you're interested in, in getting this expansion. There we go. Ooh, so they taped them. They have some pretty wide tape, it looks like. There's that. Here, I'll pass those to you. First up, we have the black. It's pretty big, about the size of my hand. It's got little points there, a lot of little points there. So it's got tentacles, a lot of eyes, as you can see. All right, so then we have six of these dark young. Look like they're half a goat with some uh, orifices with sharp pointy teeth in the front there. So there's no sense of me showing you all six at one time because they're all going to be the same. Pretty sure I don't see anything different in those. However, we do have the minion, or sorry, the uh, mythos cards. So it looks like the one we have here is the dark immol immolation. Uh, it says it deals one wound uh, to each dark young and place a fire token in its space. And this is summon a dark young on the blue. So we have dark young strike. Each dark young moves two spaces towards you. Uh, and then you get to summon another dark young. We have a dark young ritual. Looks like there is summon one cultist at each gate. And then you have to also summon a dark young. A lot of dark young coming out of here, huh? They have frenzied cultists, so each cultist moves one space towards you. Uh, wounded cultists move towards two spaces towards you, and then you have a summon cultist in the yellow gate. We have woodland scare. Each investigator takes one stress or wound if they cannot. Uh, if there are four or more dark young on the board, choose one investigator to take two extra stress for one wound for each stress they cannot take. Woof. Lord of the Woods. Uh, if you are in the same space as the Black Goat, deals one wound to each other figure in its space. Otherwise, move each dark young one space towards you. So that one's not bad. So if you're in a space with a lot of different characters or creatures or whatever, uh, it's going to deal one damage to each other figure. So that's good. And there's uh, with a thousand young. So if there are three or more dark young within one space of you, at the end of your turn, advance the Black Goat on the track as if it were three. So it counts as three of the, I um, can't remember what those symbols are called. And then we have from the Book of Ebion, or 
Edvon, even from the book of even it says choose an investigator if there are three or less dark young on the board summon a dark young into their space otherwise move two nearest uh, sorry move the two nearest dark young to their space all right and what do we have next stage cards nope we got the uh creature card so we have the minions of the black goat card here it looks like there's a cultist so it looks like they're going to get two green die they're going to have two life, and then the black young are going to get a black and a green die and three uh, damage or health. Uh, and it says the cultist, the cultist prays a thousand young. Uh, if, if, then the dark young says, if wounded but not destroyed, summon another dark young in this into its space. So basically, it just uh, keeps multiplying. That is crazy, but they're easy to kill. Three, and the dice isn't too bad, so that's that's good. Can I see that? So we have stage one. Uh, when the black goat advances, summon one dark young into your space. Deal one wound to each figure in your space. So there's that. Yeah. Stage two. When revealed, summon the black goat of the woods into your space. Then move all dark young one space towards you. Uh, and it's going to add some dice here for its combat. Whenever the black goat to uh, takes any wounds, Move the dark young that is closest to the black goat to its space, unless one's already there. We go to phase number three. Uh, and so it's going to cost 12 hit points to take him out. And so the way this kind of works is this guy is always going to stay out because that's what uh, is going to happen whenever you uh, move the little token along the track. Uh, this says, whenever, when revealed, move the black goat of the woods to the yellow gate and then summon a dark young at each gate. Uh, at the end of each turn, the black goat deals one wound to each other figure in its space and adjacent spaces. So that one's not too bad, but then we start adding these dice together. So then it's going to add another black and two more green, so it's going to get stronger. And we have the black goat of the woods at the final stage. So good thing is he's not going to add more dice, still 12. And this is revealed when uh, the black goat of the woods and all other dark young, or sorry, it says when revealed, move the black goat of the woods and all dark young to the blue gate. Uh, the black goat takes no wounds while any monster or cultists are in its space. So you have to get rid of everything else first. So that's kind of crazy. But yeah, that is the black goat of the woods expansion from Death May Die. So hopefully you like this unboxing video and just stay tuned for some more. All right, thanks for tuning in. See you guys next time. Yeah.